Alright y'all, welcome back, welcome back to another episode of G-Man Fishing. It is sometime in August we're at. If you can see all them little frogs down there moving around, that'll give you some indication of where we are. Maybe I need to have Bug get down there and get a good pick of all them frogs. But we are currently at Frog Lake. We are trying to catch some stalker trout for dinner well maybe not tonight but for dinner sometime um so yeah it's a nice warm august day we may not get any bites until dark 30 but we gonna give it a shot we got a worm and a bobber out there right now i would have brought my water shoes i could have waited out there with the fly rod but i didn't so it is what it is um, we try to do Frog Lake at least once a year, Timothy Lake, at least once a year. We won't get into the Timothy Lake, uh, thing. Yeah, it was horrid and not worth being, so we're not even going to go there. We're not even going to get into that. So. Hold on. Let me get the net wet. Okay. Why do you get the net wet? To protect the little fish. To protect the little yeah, fish. Alright. See, hold them with my hands. And the net. There you guys go, a little bitty rainbow trout. Here you go. Give me a little fishy. Well, aren't you just the cutest thing? Nuts. You have no nose. Yeet. Yeeted him back in there. Oh. Yep, it's a no. <clears throat> Krista. It's hooked up again. Oh, that's a bigger one. Yeah, that's a, might be big enough to eat. He swallowed it, so it's gonna have to be dinner. Go ahead and bring it over here, babe. Oh, that one's... That one's dinner size. So... <laughs> dinner size! Oh yeah, that's the dinner size. I mean, he's still small, but he's dinner size. Well, he didn't swallow too bad. We probably could get that hook out and let him go. Because he does look small to me. He don't look like no eight inches. Oh, whoa, wet in my hands, so... I'm not really mistreating this fish, y'all. Wait a minute again, just so you guys can see. He's just barely hooked in the in there. He just determined to flip and flop. See, just barely hooked in there. Well, 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 come here. Mm. <laughs> mm. It's like, no, I'm not mm. hooked yet. Goodbye. Oh, but I got a fish too. Yep. It's like, see, there you go. Where at? I'm look oh yeah, it looks like they're doing yoga. They're doing paddleboard yoga. Now I wish I had a paddleboard and I would ride the tuna. <laughs> or swim underneath them and hit their boat so they fall off so they can do water yoga. <laughs> and then put them put rocks on their back. 
There we go, there's another one. There's one that looks like it might be keeper's melt. Keeper's melt size. This one's gonna be fine. He's hooked in the snout. Not in the... Well, I thought that last one was gonna be fine because he wasn't hooked deep, but he still, for whatever reason, did not make it. Okay, another undersized trout, y'all. What in my hand, not keeping him out of water. And I, and I, there you guys go. And he's off. An orange popsicle. Okay, YouTube, I want to show you guys what I caught now. I, I'm not fishing for little guys, but you it's know, right. it's kind of like. Uh, been my luck today but i uh managed to catch the smallest fish in the in the frog lake and it's just a little bitty looks like a shiner of some sort um but yeah there you guys go trophy fishing at its best youtube you know i, I don't complain about the size I, I just like to catch them but uh you know that's uh not what I was fishing for, but uh, you know, if we were in bass country, I'd throw him on and try and catch a bass or something. But I hooked him pretty bad in the gut. Okay, I just caught a salamander. I don't know how this happened. Um, um, dad just went to the car and so did JC to go get some water. I don't know if he's supposed to be in the water or like what, but I just caught his, I was going to ring in, reel in the line because, I don't know, I thought, you know, I want to get in the water and I don't want to like leave the pole on the shore. That one didn't take long. <laughs> just barely hit the water and, and had that one on. Eh, it's still a small one. That's a small mouth bass? No. That one's actually that one's actually a keeper size one there. There's one. Eleven more and you'll have enough for dinner. There we go. Yeah, I think he's still small. I don't think he's no eight inches. So we'll release him. So why did Cammy go to jail? What's that? You know why Cammy went to jail? Nope. Have no clue. Make sure I'm recording. Yeah, I am. I have no clue. I. Can you say your name? And my PO goes, well, I can't tell you anything about it. Huh, yeah, I don't know. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Oh, it's still bud. No, it's too small. Whoop. There you go. There you go. All right.
Another one. Salamander. Yep. No, he didn't. He did not swallow it this time. Thank goodness. You wanna come let this one go? Okay. Yo, we got just a salamander. And it looks like we got a bite on the power bait. Going on. I'm gonna let you go, little bud. I'm gonna let you go. I'm not gonna kiss you because you're poisonous and toxic to ingest, but I will let you go. So, that way. Yep, yeah, there. Alright, let go, little bud. Place the windows with something else. All right, y'all. Thank you for joining us on another episode of G-Man Fishing here at Frog Lake. Y'all have a good one. That's Bug Bait. That's JC. And this is G-Man. We out.